Hey guys, welcome back to Tarot by Cherie. This reading today is for Aquarius, and we're going to get started right away. Let's see what the cards have for you guys today. All right, Aquarius. <clears throat> Okay, so guys, uh, some of you have put an ending to your relationship recently and it caused you a lot of pain and hurt and yeah, you're not feeling well. You're not feeling good. Okay, this was somebody that you've been with for a long time and you were feeling stuck in the relationship, okay? And you've just gotten out of that and there was someone... Your partner who is feeling a lot of regret right now, um, I guess they're, they did something that they're feeling very regretful about, okay? Um, you were happy at one time and, you know, your relationship was very strong until they did something and they ruined it basically, guys. They ruined the relationship and they're feeling extremely regretful right now. Yep, they're heartbroken and so are you guys okay this has caused a lot of pain for some of you um you know right now you guys are are in this place you're just feeling confused and hurt and this was a bad ending okay there was a huge fight a big blowout and it was a bad ending and you guys are kind of like not really understanding and not knowing how to start over um and how to get past this okay but so you know what I'm hearing guys is take some time out for yourself take a spiritual rest um, you know look inside yourselves don't get back into a relationship right away and um, but I, I do see someone who is already in your life that wants to give to you they have a lot to offer you okay and they are gonna make this offer um, Yeah, they're saying take it slow. Don't rush into this if you're going to take this offer. Okay. And I have the judgment card here. Okay. So there is karma involved with this somehow. All right. This is somebody's karma. This is a lesson that somebody had to learn. A painful one, but someone had to learn this lesson, guys. Okay. Unfortunately, this relationship is not, you can't fix it. Okay. Okay. It can't be put back together again because it ended so badly, okay? And there will never be trust. There will never be trust again in this relationship. If you're thinking about, you know, maybe there's a way that you guys can, you know, fix it or over time. No, okay? The cards are saying absolutely not, okay? Um, take this spiritual time, this rest, and heal, and then in time, I do see another offer and a new beginning coming in for you. Okay. Um, it's somebody that is very spontaneous and they just, they're, they're smart, they're intelligent, and but they, they, they're very spontaneous. They like to just do things on the spur of the moment. Okay. And sometimes they don't really put a lot of thought into what they're doing. And that might be their downfall. But other than that, this person is, you know, they're all good. Um, and you're going to get clarity on this eventually. But right now, you guys are kind of feeling stuck and, and thinking. You keep thinking about what happened. You keep going over it in your head and over it in your head. And guys, I'm sorry you're going through that. Um, you are eventually going to heal. And you're going to start thinking about something new that you want that you're going to start manifesting. Okay, and you know now that you don't, you know what you don't want, guys. You know what you don't want. You don't want sneaky, you don't want stuff going on in the background, and you're going to be a lot more, you're going to use a lot more discernment next time, okay, for the next relationship. Um, you're going to get over this, you're going to feel balanced out, and you're just going to work hard and put put your, you know, your energy into work, and I do see that, um, You'll be committed to that. You'll just be like, you know, healing and putting a lot of time into working and your finances. Okay. 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 For some of you, I see this big transformation coming, like uh, all new opportunities opening up for you. And I'm getting this uh, 
feminine energy. Okay. Um, this person is very spiritual, guys. And they are going to bring you happiness. Okay. Um, yeah, I see this coming in, guys. I see that you're getting intuition on this person or you're going to be. Okay. And for those of you who are feeling, you know, depressed right now and alone and just kind of stuck in, in, yeah, you're going to have to make a decision. You're going to have to make a decision, but you still feel burdened. You're going to still feel burdened when this person comes in regarding the last relationship. So you're not going to be over it. Uh, you're not, you're not going to feel ready. Okay. But I see this person is going to have a lot of patience, uh, for you. They're going to wait for you guys. They're going to be just whenever you're ready, this person's going to be waiting for you. Okay. And they're going, they're very possessive. Their thought process over you is, you know, it's you or no one. They want you and yeah, they're just going to hang back and they're going to do the same thing. They're going to, they're going to put themselves into work. They're not going to date other people. They're going to wait for you. Okay. Yeah. Okay. And when you are ready, this person's going to come in and they're going to bring in a lot of good things for you. All right. And yeah, they're manifesting this right now. Um, they're, they're hanging in the back and yeah, they're waiting for you guys. Okay. They see you as this, um, they see, they look up to you and they really, they like everything about you and they want to, you know, they want to ask you out, but they're going to be very patient. They're going to understand. They know. And this is somebody that you know, guys. It's somebody in your circle. Okay. And there's, there's some kind of karma going on. Okay. Um, that last relationship was karmic, guys. Okay. It, you had to do it. You had to go through it. You had to be with this person. And there was a lesson and a teaching involved in this relationship. Okay. So it wasn't for nothing. Okay. You didn't go through this for, for nothing. Um, it had to be the way it was. Okay. And I see now you're working on your finances. Okay. Or you're going to be, you're going to be putting everything into that. Okay. To keep yourself busy. So you're not going to feel so anx anxious, you know, work will take that a, a big part of the anxiety away. And so will the new person who, who is going to be coming in, this new person is going to be also working hard on their finances and waiting for you. So all in all guys, uh, when you get together with your person, um, you're going to be doing incredible financially together. Okay. And you're going to be very happy. All right. Here you guys are. And yep, here you guys are. And the sun is happiness, guys. It's happiness and all good things coming into your life. Okay. And, uh, yeah. Yep. So then I see, um, you guys are going to get together. You're going to feel like celebrating. Um, you're going to be, you know, very stable with this person. Okay. And this is like an emotional, uh, sweep me off my feet card. This person is going to, you might not see it at first, but after you date this person a few times, they are going to sweep you off your feet, guys. Okay, they want to give you their cup. Um, and this person is a very romantic, emotional person at times. They can be emotional, okay? And yeah, you're going to be getting news on that soon. Uh, about this new person, there's no rush, guys. Like I said, this person is willing to wait for you. Okay, guys, that's a reading for today. I hope you enjoyed it. Please like and subscribe to my channel. Thank you.